Good morning children how are you all today's i will teach to you computer subject lesson number first evolutions of computers in the uh, early 17th centuries the world computers referred to the people who perform mathematical calculation it is only in the last 100 years that the world computer has been used to refer to machines now a day computers are used to used in all areas of life however the evolutions of computer can be traced back to 5000 years ago in a device called abacus let us learn more about it first one is abacus an abacus is of the earliest known machines that was used for computations they were mainly used to count revenues in trade by the ancient babylonian civilization and abacus is a rectangular shaped block that hold balls or beads on vertical rods the beads are moved by hand to perform arithmetic calculations and abacus is considered as the most ancient ancient chinese computer second one is pascal line pascal line was the first ma- mathematical calculating machine that was invented in 1642 Blasik Pascal a French mathematician invented Pascal lines when he was just 19 years old this machine with its gear and wheels could perform additions and subtractions hence it could do multiplication only by repeated addition and division by repeated di- subtractions to sum up Pascal line was used to perform addition, subtraction, multiplications and division. It could calculate numbers till 9 crore 99 lakh 99999. Third one is analytical engine. Around 300 years ago in 1833 Charles Babbage on English mathematicians designed a calculating device called the analytical engine. This machine provided the basic framework of the computers. Now, one thing is note: E N I A C was the first electronic computer, which required eighteen hundred square feet areas. and weighted more than 27 tons now we will see introducing the computers every time a new technology is introduced the computer system advance to become a more reliable machines that is easier to use this stage of developments of the computer have been categorized into five generations of the computers now generation of computer first generation computers durations 1940 to 1956 the first generation computers used large vacuum tubes for processing information they were large in size and very costly the first generation computers also consumed to lot of electricity and produced excess heat they were the first generation of computer they use simple machine language they could perform only one task at a time these computer were large in size slow expensive and cons- consumed a lot of energy for example the univac 1 the first generation computer weighed more than 27000 kg second generation computers 
ड्यूरेशन नाइनटीन फिफ्टी सेवेन टू नाइनटीन सिक्सटी थ्री द सेकेंड जनरेशन कंप्यूटर्स यूज ट्रांसिस्टर्स टू रिप्लेस द यूज ऑफ ओक्यूम ट्यूब्स दे वेयर सोलेली बेस्ड ऑन द यूज ऑफ मैग्नेटिक टैब्स दे वेयर स्मॉलर इन साइज दे जनरेटेड लेस हीट एंड रिक्वायर्ड लेस इलेक्ट्रिसिटी एज कंपेयर टू द फर्स्ट जनरेशन कंप्यूटर द सेकेंड जनरेशन ऑफ कंप्यूटर यूज असेंबली लैंग्वेज विच मेड इट पॉसिबल टू क्रिएट प्रोग्राम्स फॉर परफॉर्मिंग टास्क सम ऑफ द न्यूली इंट्रोड्यूसिंग प्रोग्रामिंग लैंग्वेज दैट कम इन टू एक्सिस्टन्स ड्यूरिंग दिस जनरेशन वेयर कॉवेल बेसिक लैंग्वेज एंड फोर फोर ट्रन दिस कंप्यूटर्स वेयर स्मॉलर एज कंपेयर टू फर्स्ट जनरेशन कंप्यूटर्स मोर एफिशियंट्स फास्टर्स चिपर्स एंड लेस एनर्जी फॉर एग्जाम्पल आई बी एम नाइनटीन ट्वेंटी एंड आई बी एम वन फोर जीरो वन नाउ थर्ड जनरेशन कंप्यूटर्स ड्यूरेशन नाइनटीन सिक्सटी फोर टू नाइनटीन सेवेंटी वन द थर्ड जनरेशन कंप्यूटर्स इंट्रोड्यूस द इंटीग्रेटेड सर्किट्स means ic to replace the transistors the third generation computers had memory in the form of magnetic tabs they used operating system and other software during this time many programming language were developed pascals and rpg languages were the most commonly used programming language tab and disk were used as storage media the input device for the third generation computers was the keyboards printers were used for output they were much smaller and in size and had better speed than the computers of of previous generations the third generations of computers were small in size faster with st- storage media efficient as compared to the previous generation For example, IBM six fifty and seven hundred series. Now, fourth generation computers, durations nineteen seventy two. to present the four generation of computer are present day computers that work with microprocessors the microprocessors in also known as a cpu the micro microprocessors use silicon chips that contains thousands of integrated circuits the integrated circuits circuits are form using the large scale integrated lsi and very large scale integrated gratians vlsi the computer now are much smaller in size and fitted easily on a disk the input devices for the fourth generation computers include keyboards mouse scanners etc the output devices include monitor printer plotter speaker etc ibm introduced the uh, personal computer pc for home and office use they use less electricity and generated less heat they are easily available to everyone this is also the internet age and the fourth generation of computer are able to connect the internet ms dos operating system and window operating system were introducing by microsoft laptop have also been introduced in this era the computers of fourth generations are more reliable they are small in size and portable for example apple Mac, Macintosh and IBM PC. Now, fifth generation computers, present and future. Fifth generation computers are t- still in the development stage. The fifth generations of computers are developed using artificial intelligence. These computers have very high speed. This is a modern technology that can understand spoken language and take directions. given orally by a human beings and has many more applications this computer thinks behave and react similar to the humans for example ibms oston and apple siri